It's the most difficult task a coach will ever undertake. When one of your players dies, yesterday that happened when Minneapolis South sophomore Shaquem Adams drowned in Lake Nokomis. Head coach Lenny Sedlak is trying to help his team heal. Minneapolis South football coach Lenny Sedlock rushed to Lake Nokomis yesterday to give a pep talk he never wanted to give when he met with his players to discuss the drowning of one of their teammates and shining friends. As an athlete, uh, you know, he, he just worked so hard at becoming, a, as far as the football end, because football, he just cared so much about and he had such a passion for it. Today, the same group that was at the lake gathered to lift weights to be with each other. They're not ready to talk about it, and they're being comforted. People want them to understand. It's because I know we have some guys on our team, they, have some, they, feel, they were feeling some guilt, and they, and they still might, and that's, that's okay, but they need to realize that it's not their fault. What happened is a tragic, tragic accident. Adam's mother has been the rock the last 24 hours. She addressed the team at an emotional meeting last night. You know, I looked around the room and the tears there were, and she is standing up, and instead of asking for comfort, she is giving comfort. She is comforting our players and letting them know, hey, I'm so glad you were with him. On Monday, the coach will gather the team at this field for the first official practice without a promising player and a dear friend. As young as he was, our upperclassmen saw him this summer as a leader, and I, that says a lot. Obviously, a very difficult time. Trent yeah. Tucker is the athletic director of all Minneapolis schools. Mm -hmm. He'll be in the studio with me tonight on CCO Radio. Okay. All right. Thanks, Maxie.